Welcome into After the Whistle. I'm Phil Bonatti here at Hawk Tree Golf Club, one of the signature courses here in Bismarck. Summer, a big season of golf, and we walk you through one of the best holes here at Hawk Tree. I'm now here with Michael Herzog, the PGA head professional here at Hawk Tree. Uh, welcome to After the Whistle. Thank you. Thank you, Phil. Appreciate it. Excited to be here. And we have uh, hole 16 you chose to highlight for us. Just take me through why this is the one you picked. Awesome. You bet, Phil. Yeah, so 16 is one of our signature holes here at Hawk Tree Golf Club. It's a par 4 playing about here from the Hawk Tees, just over about 360 yards. It does have some elevation to it. It's a great closing hole in the sense that with the variety of tees that we have here to offer, the four tees and with the combinations, you have eight different ways to play it. Uh, it's a great way to kind of finish up any kind of stroke play or match play event or just even your round in general. So uh, I'm excited to share hole 16 today and how we can play this and play it at your best. Today we have uh, where the pin is, a little close to the green there on the, on the front edge of the green. Uh, how would you approach this hole today? Well, this, this, like you said, this is a risk-reward hole. Uh, there's really two ways to play this hole. You know, for those that just want to try to get out with that uh, par uh, and, and get a really good chance at birdie, the, the safest play is to go down the right side of the fairway, leave yourself uh, a good 100, 115 yard shot into the green, uh, give yourself a good placement, shot, and then uh, make that birdie. If not, just finish up with par. The reward is, is, and I've seen it often sometimes, is you go for the green, right? And uh, you hit that immaculate tee shot onto that green. Uh, definitely leave yourself a good opportunity to an eagle putt for sure, kind of wrap up the birdie. So those are the kind of the two ways to play the hole. And uh, today I'm excited to maybe show you both ways that we can play it. We're back here uh, at your second shot, Michael, and this is kind of the safe approach area we were talking about. And yep. uh, tell, take me through what you have left as we uh, approach the hole. Yep, so I did take a five iron. Uh, we talked about leaving myself under about 115 yards. What I have left is 70 yards here to a front uh, pin on the right side of the green. So the play here is if, 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 if viewers can tell, it, it kind of undulates and goes down towards the flag. So this is one based on how soft the conditions are right now, I'm gonna to wanna to land it short and let it kind of run onto the green. There's a lot of still risk reward here. Risk being that if I, any further left I go, I, uh, I open up and engage the creek there on the left side. Uh, so for me, just to play this safe to get out of here with a chance at birdie or par better, I'm gonna aim right towards the uh, middle of the green here on the front side. All right, Michael, risk reward, and you are rewarded handsomely with an yeah. eagle putt here chance. I mean, uh, you don't have much left here on this on this uh, green, but take me through what you have left. Yeah, I probably got about uh, 45, 50 feet here for my eagle putt, uh, Phil, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep the flag stick in just because this green is going back down towards the creek. Uh, so if there's any chance it does hit over the cup, I have the flag stick to stop it. Now, with the new rules, we can keep the flag stick in, and there's no penalty. So I'm going to use it as a resource. I obviously lined up. Uh, the line on my ball to where I want to hit my spot. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to try to leg this down uh, and uh, again, try to get out here with a three or better. Any right to left, left to right here? Or is uh, there's, it... some, there's some change into the green, but a lot of times uh, I just want to focus on distance and direction. Uh, anytime I, 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 work, I, I focus too much on that, uh, I'm not confident on my stroke. So I'm going to focus on distance and direction, uh, which I got my direction lined up, and now I'm going to focus on the distance, like I said, try to get out here with a three or better. All right, Michael, good work on the 16th hole, uh, you know, and hopefully uh, people can uh, better their game because of uh, the way you uh, guided us through this one. I appreciate it, Phil. It was uh, very nice to do this today and uh, uh, excited that we could share hole 16 with our viewers today uh, from Hawk Tree Golf Club. And uh, thank you very much for the experience. And for the viewers out there, uh, uh, love to have you out here. You're welcome anytime. All right. Thank you for being on After the Whistle.